you're the second most famous Muslim from Kentucky, and given that the first most famous was the most famous man in the entire world, that's not a bad achievement, Sean. Tell us how it no, came no, about. I'll take it. <laughs> no, you know, he's been a hero of mine. You know, I, I got a chance to even meet him when I was a little boy growing up in Kentucky. And um, no, I, I will never be a more famous Muslim or a more famous Kentuckian than him. And that's just fine with me, man. <laughs> <laughs> How did you come to embrace Islam? You were once a Christian pastor. Yeah, well, I'm, in a lot of ways, um, even my my heart for Jesus still always gave me a, a soft spot a, a soft spot rather for Islam you know I you may have heard me tell this story George but I first visited a mosque when I was just 16 years old in high school uh, in Kentucky uh, I didn't grow up in Louisville I grew up uh, near Lexington and uh, it, you know I, I went to uh, Juma prayer for several Fridays as a teenage boy and even just those early visits, uh, it really planted a seed in my heart. And so for most of my adult life, everybody knew me as a, a friend of Muslims, as an advocate for Muslims. But I was always doing that as a Christian. And uh, I would do interfaith events. I mean, I've been fighting for Palestine since I was a college student all the way back in uh, 2001. And and yet, um, you know, this year I found myself... Uh, just so deeply moved by the faith of Muslims, not just in Gaza, but around the world, that it, it created what was really like an existential crisis for me where I realized there was something that they had, that they knew, that they understood, that I wanted for myself and my own family. And so uh, it just took me almost on a, a full circle moment of what I was first exploring as a boy after reading the autobiography of Malcolm X. And uh, and now my wife and I and even some of our children have become Muslims. And it's just been a, a, a rich, rewarding time for us. And I don't know that I would have been able to even uh, endure the difficulty of seeing all that is happening in Gaza, even if if not for my young faith as a Muslim. And so... Uh, it's even helped me be be strong and and be determined throughout all of this, George.